Kevin, well, I'm sorry. You, you've touched, I'm sorry. You've touched on the impact program earlier, and now we're talking about the corporations like Amazon and others. Uh, what kind of efforts have been made to tie in with the employee resource associations in there, like Glamazon, for instance, of Amazon, where they have an LGBTQ uh, workforce there? Yeah. And are there plans to expand on that later? You know, that's a really good question, Don, and that's not an area that we've gotten into yet. Uh, as we came, I mean, and I want to, I'll tie that back to something Robin said. Um, you know, we're, we have an aggressive effort just as we recruit businesses. We're aggressively working to recruit talent to our community. It's our Live Life Here initiative. We're doing some amazing things. I, I don't know what Bryce on our team does. He's some type of uh, social media wizard. He's all in the background, but, but targeting individuals to relocate to our community. I mean, it's about talent. At the end of the day, I'm interested in talent and how do we get, you know, my Lockheed facility here has 400 engineers. Yes. Um, how are we going to bring those engineers in? I have companies that are headquartered here like Signature Brains and Closet Made and, and uh, uh, Custom Windows Pella. So how do we bring in that talent? So, um, uh, you know, we're doing a lot of work in that area. I think as we continue to look at how we build that out, um, uh, that was, that's a great resource. We just, we're just not quite there yet, but yeah. we're building out those pieces to that. Well, speaking of Lockheed, uh, I'm aware that they have about 60 employees are LGBTQ community and they want to get involved with uh, the local, you know, area. So that might be something to tie in with uh, speakers for the impact yeah. program and, and lectures on the program. I'm jotting some notes. Okay, good. <laughs> we're, we're getting close to the 30 minute mark. And that was a great segue to what I was thinking was like the close. And it's really about, um, because we're both focused on the LGBTQ community first and everybody else that loves and supports them, what would be the call to action or what would you say to LGBT folks that are talent or have amazing businesses or innovation uh, about the CEP and Ocala, Mary, Marion County, like what's the pull? What's yeah. the pitch to them? You know, I, so I think it's, let's talk two parts. One is, to, let's talk the business part. Um, this is a place where your business can be successful. Uh, this is a place that grows and support and nurtures businesses. Uh, and that's what we do here. Uh, you know, we're gonna help you earn that return on investment. We love to help businesses be successful and that's all businesses. Um, so if, if growing your business and your business being successful is important to you, this is the place to do it. We're going to provide you with the resources across the board, one stop. Um, and if you will, to borrow a phrase from another organization, it's a big tent. Uh, it's a big tent. Um, I love uh, and I appreciate affinity chambers, mm -hmm. um, but we want to make sure that you're getting exposed to all the businesses. Uh, and so we're really going to take and, and, and take advantage and, and help promote and network that way. For individuals, man, listen, if you like sunshine and uh, you like affordability and you don't like paying uh, income tax, this is an amazing place to live. Uh, you get all the advantages of being here in Florida, but because we're central Florida, we don't have to worry about hurricanes or any sea level rise. None of that's really about our, our issue directly. Uh, you get all the benefits without any of the downside. And if you need the beach, you can be on the Atlantic an hour and a half. You can be in the Gulf in about 50 minutes. So, mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, thank you. Uh, do you have any questions of us or anything that we could answer? Listen, I, I'm just so excited that you all were for a chance to talk about this. We've loved working with John and seeing as Embrace grows and, and what's going on there. It does such a phenomenal uh, job. Robin, I, I'm really interested to see more about it. We understand your publication and how we can help promote and, and uh, just again, we're all about partnerships. Uh, and so we're, we're always looking for that opportunity. This has been amazing. I, I'm trying not to smile so much so that my teeth aren't like all over the screen, but my face hurts from smiling. <laughs> and I'm thrilled uh, of the possibility. And we'll certainly have magazines available um, right. down uh, for you guys and the digital part of it. So we'll connect on socially driving these ideas. And we'll probably go talk to some of those businesses, the big brands that are there to say, hey, look at this great work your partner is doing, and here's what we think it means for the rest of your organization. So that's a conversation I'm excited to have as well. Excellent, very good. Well, listen, thank you all and, and happy Friday. We're, yes, we're a little bit closer to the Friday. weekend now. Thanks. Absolutely. All right.